I was just making ooh. I was just making sure my Miss Katie didn't think she was too old to be down here with us. Are you getting ready to start school? I'm going into sixth grade. But it's getting ready to start soon, isn't it? Yes. I know. Yeah. Part of you sad because some are so much fun, but part of you is glad, tell me. No, please. Yes. See, friends, you got to learn. You can't stay, I mean. You think I enjoy math? Yes. You're talking oh. to the wrong person. And you're a psychopath. No, I love math. Okay. Do your parents take a lot of pictures? Okay. Grandparent, your mom does. My mom is obsessed with that. And why do you think she's obsessed with taking pictures? She wants to remember the memories. So one day, when Katie and Nora meet the right person, and they decide that they want to get married or not, you got to show all those crazy-looking pictures from, I'm going into the fifth grade, so everybody can see what you looked like. So they're for memories for us to remember. When Jesus went back to heaven to be with his father, he left behind a picture for us to remember him by. It isn't a picture in an album or on an iPhone. It really isn't a picture that someone took with a mechanical device. Okay? But we can look at it and remember what Jesus looked like. It's a picture to help us to remember what Jesus did, and it's called the Last Supper. Now, based on what was said in the Bible, this is one of the paintings that someone used to depict what the Bible said about the Last Supper, the last time Jesus sat down with his disciples. Okay? Did it look exactly like this? Of course, we have no idea. And there are thousands of different depictions of that actual event. Okay. Just before Jesus was crucified, he called all of his disciples together for a meal. Okay. He took a piece of bread, and he told the disciples that the bread was to remind them of his body that would be hung on a cross for them. Then he took a glass of wine and told them that the wine was to remember the blood of that would be shed for him on, for them on that cross. He told them that whenever they ate the bread and drank the wine, it was to remember and remind them of what he had done for them. We still eat the bread. We drink the wine today. And when we do, it is to help us to remember what Jesus has done for us. So it's like a memory, a photograph, that when we see the sacraments on the altar, they are to remind us of what Jesus has done for us, shed his blood and his body to forgive our sins, so that we can have time together with him in heaven. So can we bow our heads, close our hands? Dear Lord, thank you so much for giving us this picture to help remind us of what you did for us when you died on that cross so, so many years ago. Help us to always remember and to always be thankful. And all the children said, Amen.